tragic toddler murder case returns to court as a local mother who was previously convicted of killing her 19-month-old daughter fights for a new trial and a chance to clear her name. Eyewitness News reporter Catherine Sotnik joins us live now with new details. Well, Karen, today's hearing is aimed at determining whether or not Kimberly Mawson will get a new trial. Several witnesses were called to the stand today, but they pled the Fifth Amendment and did or didn't answer any questions at all. Our news partners at the Providence Journal say several witnesses were called to the stand Tuesday in the Kimberly Mawson hearing to determine if she'll get a new murder trial and the death of her 19-month-old daughter, Jade. First up, Mawson's ex-boyfriend, Daniel Fusco. The journal reports he pled the fifth when Mawson's attorney asked him whether or not he told his father that he shook the child and slammed her to the floor when she wouldn't stop crying. The journal also says Michael Fusco, Daniel's father, also refused to answer questions pleading the Fifth Amendment as well. Two months ago, Kimberly Mawson was released from the ACI after spending two and a half years out of a 35-year sentence behind bars for the murder of that child back in Warwick in 2002. At the time of the trial, Daniel Fusco, Mawson's ex-boyfriend, was a key witness in the case. Mawson was released after Fusco's former attorney came forward, claiming his client confessed to the crime. And Richard Corley, Daniel Fusco's former attorney, was also expected to take the stand today. I'm Catherine Slotnick, Eyewitness News.